Good morning, SourceFed. I'm Trisha Hirschberger. I'm William Hayes. Will, do you believe in fairies? Why, why are you asking me that? Do you believe in fairies? No, not really. So, if I was Tinkerbell and I just drank poison to save your green tight wearing life and I was about to die and the only way that you could save me was by clapping your hands to show your enthusiastic belief in fairies, then would you believe in fairies? Uh, yeah, yes, then I guess I would. Okay. Or what if I could prove fairies with science? Now that would be something I'd like to share with my dad. In the Namib Desert in Africa, bare patches of land surrounded by thriving plant life are popping up like crazy. There's actually millions of them and in fact they can grow up to 65 feet in diameter and live up to 75 years. Scientists have no idea what the heck they are or how they're formed, but they're nicknamed fairy circles. So scientists think fairies landed on the earth and left a patch of dead soil in their wake. I don't buy it. Well, theories range from grass killing CO2 that seeps out of the earth to weird termite feeding patterns to, you know, fairies. But by examining the fairy circles from above via high tech aerial imaging, scientists came up with a new theory. Surprisingly, the circles have a somewhat regular spacing and distribution, even across very large large areas. One of the researchers, Stephen Getson, said, the occurrence of such patterning in nature is rather unusual. There must be particularly strong regulating forces at work. Regulating forces like a fairy army and that's the order that the foot soldiers stand in? Or that all the vegetation is competing for water and nutrients and that's the pattern naturally caused. Or that, yeah. So if a bunch of fairy circles popped up in your backyard, what would you do? Let us know in the comments section. I'd start my own fairy army and then I'd send them to countries that didn't agree with my country. I do less important things and pretend that the grass is lava and I can only step in the circles and I try to be Mario in the original Super Mario Brothers and run straight across without dying to finally figure out why you can run across but you can't walk. Wow. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. And also check out our annotations. I'm Trisha Hirschberger. And I'm William Haynes. Fairies. I don't think it's fairies. Nah. nah. They don't exist, Trisha. Come on. <laughs>